come in with an absolute cracker. Absolute cracker. Beautiful delivery. Top delivery. Well, Stein's just got himself into a bit of trouble here as well. He's given Samuels a send-off. The umpire straight away got on the mic. He's going to have a word with probably Graham Smith as well. So it's a pity that that happened, but it was a great delivery. Excellent innings as well. Samuels has gone for 105. What a great ball. Look at that. Top of off. Oh, as you say. Better to get it when you got a hundred and not when you got naught. That was maybe a little unnecessary. Well played, Marlon Samuels. 105 for him. 292 now for six. Ball. Out. That's exactly what's happened. Samuels going for a big hook, drags it back onto the off stump. And now we will see. One, two, three, four. Well, two quick wickets just shows you what a run out can do. Trouble now for the West Indies. South Africa strike back. Dale Stain does the damage. Samuels is on his way for a well played 40. it is 123 for four out brilliantly caught by Callis at second slip Stain gets his man uh, what is it <laughs> 80 runs later but he gets it well it's a pity from Marvin Samuels's point of view he played pretty well today he applied himself well it was a full delivery but it swung he Pretty much threw the kits and sink at it. Not much footwork there and a thick outside edge went to Jacques Cullis who caught a very good catch at second slip. An important breakthrough from a South African point of view. After a very, very patient innings, finally goes for 94. West Indies 277 for four. 